Are you ready? No, I said, are you ready? We're here to fight Brock. It's me, it's me, it's DRB. His rock hard willpower is evident even in his Pokemon and lack of Viagra pills. It's Brock. My Pokemon are all rock hard and have true grit determination. That's right, my Pokemon are all the rock type. Fua ha ha! You're going to challenge me knowing that you'll lose? That's the trainer's honor that compels you to challenge me. Fine then, show me your best. Um, I'm gonna go out on a limb and say you're probably a liar, and I would be shocked if you ended up with even one rock type out of your two. Preschooler Scott sent out Kakuna. Well, I was a little worried about this battle for nothing, it seems. We're gonna send out, uh, we're gonna abuse some experience here, because I doubt he's gonna do anything crazy. I doubt he's running, uh, doubt he's running, uh, Blast Burn Kakuna. We're going to send out CM Punk. Because I assume he'll just use uh, Harden. Yeah. And when he does use Harden, I can just hit him with a special attack. Like Confusion. I can send uh, Kali back out to finish this off. Uh, starting off a little easy. Easier than fighting the goddamn Rayquaza. That was fun. Alright, CM Punk used Weather Ball. That's it. He has... Water Absorb. What what are the astronomically small chances that the metronome attack I get gets deflected by his randomized ability? Huh? Someone do the math for that. And when you do, don't. Don't do that. That's a waste of time. I fucking... I swear to God. Oh, that's how this episode is starting, isn't it? Thanks, CM Punk, you gigantic piece of shit. God damn it. I'd be mad about that if it was any other Pokemon. Man, that was a little bit underwhelming. Didn't even kill the Kakuna. Let's get that confusion up, though, and get this thing over with. Well, we're down to three. <laughs> However, we're down to the three I enjoy. <laughs> so Our team's getting whittled down pretty quick. Maybe I'll just be able to use... Oh, what's he got? Articuna. Fucking... No, I don't want this. Shit probably has powder snow. Oh, he's level 14. We're in the rain. This doesn't help either of us. Well, he's got Gust. If need be, I could... Oh my god! Oh god. I almost threw up. We can't lose Kali. Right. I, don't, I, don't, I don't care about... I don't care about CM Punk. I don't care that we lost Togepi just now. I cannot, in any universe... <laughs> Lose Kali. Kali is my special attacker. Did you see how much damage that just did to an Articuno? Hit me with the... Oh, oh, he's got soundproof. Good thing I didn't use... I don't know. Boom burst or... Uproar. Outroar. Outrage? Uproar. Move his outroar. Fuck. <laughs> oh, can you tell that uh, that Mr. Mind bit just made me very scared. Oh, here comes that powder snow. Do not die. Don't die. Don't die. No, no, no. Oh, thank God. Don't freeze. Oh, thank God. The move is Uproar. There's also a move called Outrage, but it's Dragon. For some reason, my brain, in its primal state of fear, mixed those moves up a whole bunch. Whew. We made it through. We only had one casualty, and it's a casualty I don't care about, so it's alright. Alright, preschooler Scott, you're awful tall for a preschooler. Got some goofy pants on. Don't wear forest green and black at the same time, especially if your outfit has brown on it. That top is kind of cool, though. I'd wear that top. Just having the boulder badge makes your Pokemon more powerful. It also enables the use of the move Flash outside of battle, just for that one part that you can't get through without using Flash. Of course, a Pokemon must know the move Flash to use it. DRB got 1400 for winning. Which is good, because we don't have any goddamn money. Wait! Take this with you. All right, we got TM39. Now, I don't remember if I randomized the TMs. I, I know I did, but I don't know if it ran. Okay. TM case. Cotton Spore. That's a great move. The Rock can learn Cotton Spore. <laughs> CM Punk can't, because he's dead. You'll notice there was a little bit of a, a lapse back there. I keep hitting the wrong button. I keep screwing up this footage. So I have, I have to keep editing small bits out, like just microseconds, because 
I keep hitting this button and it changes the screen and I have to edit it out. And just ignore it if you see it. If it was super obvious. The last time I did it, it was not obvious. This one was more obvious. All right, which PC should be accessed? Accessed someone's PC. God, the dialogue, or the text. There's Vader. <laughs> you get a buddy. Oh, there we go. Place. All right, so we should heal. Now I get to go take on those other t -t -t trainers. Ba -ba 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 -da -da -do. Thank you for waiting. We've restored your Pokemon to full health. We hope to see you again. Yeah, you would. Your stupid pink hair. I know you want this Poke Dick. You want to see me again because you want to hit on me. I ain't playing that game. I'm here to be a master. Oh, crap. Running shoes. I think. There we go. All right, skipped it. Did you like my montage music? There's a letter attached. Dear DRB, here's a pair of running shoes for my beloved challenger. Remember, I'll always cheer for you. Don't ever give up for mom. <coughs> His mother is the devil. I don't know if I remember to mention that until right now. Excuse me. You looked at me, didn't you? Yeah, well, I saw your ugly face. I couldn't look away. Chef Mia. Sent out Flaffy. Oh, I hate Flaffy. All right. Hang on, I have to put the lid on my water. God forbid I put this thing on the ground without putting a lid on it. And the one time I decide not to do that, I spill it all over my recording equipment. <laughs> Kali's attack fell. Well, you guessed wrong. That did a bunch. We are about the same level, too. Oh, that tackle does considerably less than it did last time. I don't even know if he... I think he might have attacked Flygon last time. Yeah, he did. Flygon's defense it might be less. Hopefully we're going to get through most of these trainers before the episode ends. Kali's trying to learn Meditate. Man, guess what you're not learning? Meditate. I like your moves. Barrier's a good move if I get into a pickle and your defense is tested. Duskull. Should we stay in? Yeah. We'll keep using Kali. We'll get Kali some levels. Mr. Mime is our, our powerhouse for now. He's definitely our strongest as far as uh, special attacking goes. And his special attack is so much higher that it's, it's stronger than the physical attack of my other guys. So for now, Kali is our best choice to keep from dying. Here comes that bug catcher. Hey, I saw you in Viridian Forest. You kicked my ass back there. I don't actually know if I fought him. This might be just some other cool trainer male Dudley sent out seal. Oh no. I love how people, especially like really old nostalgic fans who don't really play Pokemon anymore, but they'll come out and they'll say like, Oh, an ice cream Pokemon. That's so dumb. Wow. That double flinch. You are a slut. Stop it. There we go. Oh, these Pokemon have bad designs. What's that? What's that set of keys? Oh, good. I obliterated him. And they don't remember that there's a Pokemon literally named Seal, and it is literally a seal that they made slightly blue to represent the ice type that it is. We got that Ghastly. See, here's the problem. I want to leave Kali in, but Kali's got low health, and if he use, uses something like, I don't know, Nightshade, and he's level 16, which he's not. Seal is a dumb-looking Pokemon. It's a dumb-named Pokemon. It's just... If you're going to get mad at, like, newer Pokemon generations for having bad designs, understand that every generation has some poorly designed Pokemon. It's a crit! And it's super effective. Undertaker does not play. You've unleashed the darkness. Of course, every design, every every generation has some great design Pokemon. And we got that Polyrath. Well, that puts me at a gigantic disadvantage. Um, now... If I use Dwayne Johnson, I can get off a rock throw, which is stronger than anything Undertaker is running, I think, and I'm not sending Mr. Mime back out there, unless I have to. Uh, it's only level 10. He's got Shield Dust. I don't remember what Shield Dust does. I never see it. Nobody uses Shield Dust on anything. Well, forgot that Rock was uh, not super effective against, uh, forgot he was a fighting type for just a second. Thought Rock was going to do a little bit more. 
So, do I have healing items? I do. I bought some potions. That's right. We will send Mr. Mime back out there then. Boy, that is not enough. All right, so we got that double slap, but it is not going to kill us. Uh, I think his only move might be double slap. Is this is this one of the generations where double slap literally only hits two times and it is the worst move? When they made double slap hit more than twice, it became a little better. Don't die. Don't. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh. Oh. Oh, no. Oh. Our team just got, like, 70% worse. You whore. Oh. Oh, no. That's the worst thing that could have happened to us. Oh, no. Okay. Well, one more battle. I can't believe that just happened to me. As soon as he saw the water gun, I was like, this is not going to kill me without a crit. And he got a crit. Oh. I can't believe that just happened. Oh, shit. What are we going to do now? We've got the, the next encounters. Great, he's got Sandstream. Here's your problem. I'm. It's going to help me. It's not going to help you. Get that sand tomb. What are we going to do? I think we can catch two more Pokemon before we get anywhere. Three more Pokemon before we get anywhere serious. We've got the patch of grass that's coming up past these trainers. And then Mount Moon. And then the area right before Cerulean City. And then I suppose we can go up to that next patch of grass. And catch another one. Okay, so we can we can catch a couple Pokemon before the next gen. Oh man. That was the hardest blow we could have taken. I was losing him. But I had to heal Mr. Mime. I didn't know what was gonna happen. I don't know if it's worth it. I don't know if it's worth it. Fucking water Pokemon. Jesus. The wind has been sucked out of my sails. Well, I'm going to suffer some sandstream damage. The weather still lasts eternally in this game. I don't know. I don't know if I like... I mean, I get that it was really easy to run rain teams and sand teams and, and stuff like that when weather lasted forever. If you didn't bring uh, something to counter weather, then you were just stuck in sand the whole battle. You know, that's, that's chip damage for eternity. But taking it down to five turns... Um, I don't know. I like it. It makes things a little more fair. It makes it makes it harder for you to run a sand. It makes you harder to run a weather teams in general. Sun, rain. I don't know if anyone runs hail ever. I've, I've never seen a hail team. You know what? That's what I'm making. As soon as this video ends, I'm going to go make myself a competitive hail team. You think I'm joking. It, I'm not. I'm going to put a video up of me battling with my competitive hail team. Well, so we lost uh, we lost the rock. We also lost CM Punk. That is not a huge deal. So we're down to Undertaker and Kali. We are dropping like flies, and we are just we are just beginning. <laughs> oh. I'll see you guys next time. Hopefully, we'll get through these trainers. We'll get to Mount Moon. Maybe I'll stretch the episode a little bit. We'll make it all the way through Mount Moon just so we can get to Cerulean City. <sighs> Catch some more Pokemon that are hopefully good or better than our starter. If you smell what the rock was cooking.